Hey everyone, welcome to another one evidence run. We're gonna guess the ghost together. I'm gonna do all the testing and you can make your guess to improve your skills a little bit. We're gonna play with one evidence. Breaker, basement We're left. No! Photo again. <sighs> this game is kidding me. Okay, so I'm gonna set up everything and we're gonna hop right in together. Okay, let's hop right in. The breakers in the basement on the left. Don't see a bony pants here. I've heard a knock. I think it was in the living room. Perfect, we got a hiding spot here, which is quite good. That was an ambient sound, don't worry. Okay, I hope the bone is not down here somewhere. That was another ambient sound, don't worry. Okay, let's see, is there any bony pants down here? Nope. Okay, I think Ghosty is in the living room. I thought I've heard a window knock. Like here or there? No thingies. Let's see. I know I've just turned on the breaker, it could take some time. But maybe it was also upstairs, I'm not sure. Okay, it's too warm in here, what about this? This area is the entrance area? Nope. Okay, let's keep looking for the bone first, maybe we will hear something. Maybe it could be over there. Come on, Bony, be here somewhere, please. Be right here, that would be so nice, because I need it. So it could also be here. Let's ignite that, and if the ghost blows out the candle, we'll know it. Okay, let's see, do we have a hiding spot here? Nope. I thought I heard an EMF for a split second. Okay, we got a hiding spot here, let's leave that open, but I think the other one is more convenient, because you can use that long road for testings, for speed up testings. Or if you have to look at the ghost for a while. Okay, nothing is happening here. No throws. Okay, let's turn that off in case Ghosty is there. It can do something. Maybe it was upstairs. But I heard a window knock. I'm quite sure about that. Okay. Come on, Boney, be somewhere here, please. Okay, we got a hiding spot here. No bony pants. No, I wanted to pass through first. Ghosty, was that you? Might have been Ghosty. I didn't pay attention. I didn't listen if it was that. <laughs> No hiding spot here. Okay, I've heard that you are upstairs here, huh? Somewhere around there. Okay, let's check for hiding spots here. This one is the best. Oh, Bony Pants is here, but this hiding spot is not available, unfortunately. This one is not good anyways. Okay, Bony Pants is right there, and I think Ghosty Pants might be somewhere around here, because I've heard that cup. This cup wasn't the one. Oh, damn it, we have no hiding spots upstairs. Great. Oh, damn it, my fiance is beating up his. Yeah, it's here. Oh, and that's the knock I was talking about. Okay. <sighs> so it's quite dangerous since we don't have a hiding spot here. Um, let's bring in a crucifix, a cam, and an EMF for now. But we have to check for the temps as well. So if it starts hunting now, we can hide in the room where the bone is. Even though if this hiding spot is not available, you can just use it like that. If the ghost doesn't see you, then you'll be fine. Now we are approaching the ghost room with the crucifix in our hands. I think this is the ghost room. Oh yeah, there we go. The EMF2. Thank you, Ghosty. Oh, you're also playing some ball. Interesting. The ball is moving. It wasn't me. I didn't kick it. <laughs> so, 
let's turn that off. We don't need all the lights. Let's leave all the necessary lights on. Okay, let's bring in these bodies and another crucifix. I still have to check um, if it's actually in that room because sometimes it could be in another room. Okay, let's leave that here. Knock, knock. Oh, I have to check for thingies. Okay, where would the thingies be? Let's take it like that. Okay, we need another cam, we need salt, we need UV light. It's riding, you hear that? It's riding in the book, so we got riding. We don't need any more evidence items, fortunately. So, we got ghost riding, interesting. So we know what we have to look for. That was quite early, ghosty. Let's leave that here. Okay, we can, oh, two. Right away, thank you for that. Oh, I forgot the UV light, I'm stupid. I grabbed the EMF instead of the UV. Oh, I don't need that anymore, we got writing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we don't even need a cam, it stepped into the salt. Okay, um, we had a hiding spot in the basement. So let's just set this up like that. Let's leave one sensor upstairs and we're gonna leave them here. And we're gonna leave another one here. So we can see Ghosty approaching. And we'll, yeah, we're gonna need uh, the smudges and stuff. And we're also gonna need. That was quite early, the widening. We should leave the ghost alone. You've touched the door. Light flickering, interesting. I hope it was that one. Okay, it was. Wait, did you just throw something in here? Yeah. I don't know what. Something has been thrown in there, okay. Okay, you are actually walking around in here. Interesting. How many... How many footsteps do we have? None. Okay, let's take these. Show yourself. I don't want to hang around the ghost room for too long. I hope it was that door. No, goodbye, perfect game. That's it. So, mm. screw the ghost picture then. <laughs> okay, you know what I'm gonna do? Do I need the crucifix objective? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. No, I don't. Let's grab these and place them somewhere so the ghost can't hunt on top of us. Let's place them around here. Because I don't want prevent the ghost from hunting because we should leave it alone for a while we have to do some more testings okay so we can place another flashlight down there to see some stuff um, let's grab this we can also hide in the kitchen but i'm gonna leave that off for now since we got the hiding spot in the basement I'm also gonna grab the cam. Maybe I'm gonna try to take a picture, but perfect game is ruined anyways because of that stupid door. I shouldn't have done that. I should have waited for the salt. It was my fault completely. Okay, well, fortunately we got the breaker right there, so we can keep that on. So, we're walking around quite a lot. <laughs> Ghost depends. <laughs> So I'm gonna leave that here, just... Wait a second, did you turn on that light? You have turned on the light? Thank you, ghosty. You've turned on two lights. Oh my god, that's so kind. Don't see anything here. Okay, what do we have on our list then? This is always checked. Oh, 
sorry guys, um, the Morai and the Oaken will alway, always have spirit box first because the Morai can curse you with the spirit box with the response and the Oaken has a special response on the spirit box. So we can rule out another ghost but I won't tell you of course. And it killed the breaker. Okay. That's why I like it when the hiding spot is near the breaker. I guess you can look what's that noise. Okay. It's not hunting. So if you want to be sure if the ghost is hunting, just uh, flick a light switch. And if you can't toggle it, then it's hunting. If you can toggle it, it's not hunting. <laughs> because sometimes you don't know. <laughs> okay. So we got only the most necessary lights on. Let's check our sanity. And I'm gonna try to leave the ghost alone now. Because I don't have to do that much testing, but ah, that throw sounded quite interesting. I think I'm gonna prepare some stuff. What else do I need? Ah, okay, I did everything already. <laughs> so sanity was still quite high. So as you can see, if you are using a candle and turning on the lights, you can buy yourself a lot of time, especially on large maps. On small maps, the sanity drain is higher, so you have to keep that in mind. So, <coughs> let's give the ghost something to play with. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. <sighs> I hate it when they're doing that. I have to see, at least for now, my ghost highway is lit completely. I can see everything in the dark, but where I'm preparing some stuff at the moment I need some lights Could you, if you don't mind can you please leave that alone for maybe five minutes I would appreciate that ghosty okay so I'm gonna set up everything and I'll be right back oh my god this ghost it has killed the breaker like I don't know about five times I've just turned it on before and it killed it while I passed this point so I can show you what I did in the meantime as you can see we did a nice tiny road for ghosty pants all oh, the forks are a little bit annoying but it's okay and do we have anything large left because I think there's a tiny gap in our road <laughs> Anything we can throw over there? Ah, this one is tiny. Tiny fork. Okay. Mm, the gap is here. Leave that here. So, as you can see, if the ghost comes down here, it has a nice road to follow. And if it comes to me, then it has a large jackpot to play with. <laughs> so, yeah. I set up everything. I left the ghost alone. I didn't enter the room. So let's have a look at our sanity now and then we can wait for the hunt and start with all the testings because most of them we can figure out during a hunt. But we also have to pay attention to our sanity. <coughs> so yeah, almost perfect. We are exactly in hunting range for any ghost now. Oh, you've turned on the light up there, ghosty. <coughs> Why do you turn on the lights but kill the breaker? What's the, uh, that doesn't make any sense. So we're gonna wait here. And we're gonna hide here. Let's hope we survive that. I still don't have any idea what ghost it is, but as soon as the hunt starts, we'll know. So. We're gonna wait for the hunt. I'm gonna look for a dark place where I can wait, like the living room. I'm gonna, gonna leave the lights off here. And if it starts hunting, I'm gonna get over there and wait for it to come down the stairs. So, there's the door. So as soon as something happens, I'll be right back. Okay, that's quite strange. We are at 42 sanity. There's no crucifix up there, right? Um, I can't see anything, but I don't think there's a crucifix there. Did you kill the breaker again? No, I don't 
let's see a crucifix. So it's not hunting yet. Oh, we've killed the breaker again, sure. But I think it wants to hunt soon. So we are at 42. We have to remember that because we have to keep an eye on our sanity. But if it would have used a crucifix, we would have seen it glowing. Let's see if it starts. It was just an ambient sound. Everything is fine. Let's see if it starts hunting now. Come on, Ghosty. I've prepared some stuff for you to play with. Ghosty. Ghosty, ghosty, ghosty. Did I remove all the crucifixes up from up there? I don't want to check it now because... Oh, you've heard that? <laughs> that was the crucifix. I left one there. Sorry, my bad. <laughs> okay, you heard that? So now we should see it also on the cam. So this was the first hunt hunting attempt. Let's see where our sanity was at at that moment. That's important. Okay, 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 okay. Yep, this crucifix over there. You see it? It just used that. We can rule out another ghost, knowing that. Mm, I got a suspicion here because... It wrote in the book quite early, but I wasn't around the ghost that long. Maybe it's just lazy. Could be possible. Let's see if the crucifix stops it again. <laughs> Actually fun <laughs> to see the crucifix through the ceiling <laughs> and hear the, the noise of it. Oh no, please don't do this to me now. I have to listen. No. Turn that shit off. I hate it because these radios are not anymore bound to the breaker. Because if I would love to turn that off, I would just have to kill the breaker and that's it. Oh god, I'm so sorry guys. I think... Ah, crucifix, you saw that? I didn't hear it because of that stupid radio, but... So the next hunt is gonna come through. So I'll be back as soon as it starts. Seriously guys, I don't know what I have done to this ghost. Now it killed the breaker, but that stupid radio is still going. I'm going insane here. Ah, now it's hunting. Finally, I can't hear shit. Okay, I hear enough, I think. Ghosty, hello, hello. <laughs> you heard that? I hope you've heard it. What? You didn't check this area? Are you kidding me? Hey! Hey, Ghosty! Hey! You gotta be kidding me, right? <laughs> this ghost is actually kidding me. It's teasing me. You know what? Because it's teasing me, I'm gonna tease it now. I don't care. I'm gonna tease the shit out of this ghost. That's my revenge for that stupid radio and killing the breaker constantly. I don't care. So, let's wait for the next hunt. Okay, let's go. You hear the footsteps? Come on down the stairs, come on. Hey! Here! 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 just had to do that <laughs> I just had no other choice and now I'm gonna throw that fucking radio out of the window <laughs> you little piece oh my god are there two oh. it's so goddamn loud stop it enough mean ghosty pants Okay, guys, it should be obvious what ghost it is, right? 
we should know what we are dealing with here. And I've turned on its off its radio because it was so mini. It was a mini pants. You've killed the breaker again. You know what? I don't care. <laughs> so here you got the list of ghosts. Yeah, I don't care about the photo. It's not a perfect game. Anyways, make your decision. I'm gonna make mine right now and see you back at the base. So that was obvious, wasn't it? <laughs> But I must say, this was actually a mini pants, right? A ghost pants mini pants. <laughs> so if you paid attention to the speed, you should know that this is a revenant. Welcome back. <laughs> There's some jobs ready for you. So yeah, it has no special ability. So the revenant. You can just figure it out doing a hunt. It doesn't have any um, special behavior or stuff like that. A revenant will travel at significantly faster speed when hunting their prey. Hiding from the revenant will cause it to move very slowly. So, the moment it started hunting, of course it didn't see me because I was downstairs waiting for it. It was slow, you heard it. Even though that stupid radio was on, the steps were like... Bum, bum, bum. And I was waiting until it gets to the stairs, because uh, on a different floor the ghost can't hear you. You have to wait until it comes to your floor. The moment it went down the stairs and triggered the sensor, I was screaming like crazy. And for the Revenant, if it either sees you, hears you, or senses your equipment, it's gonna move quite fast to that location. It's gonna speed up like crazy. And you heard it, what happened. I was uh, calling for it and it was following me down the stairs. I just, screaming once didn't uh, work, I don't know why, it forgot, it searched the location but it forgot that I was around the corner, I don't know how that happened, <laughs> maybe because it was a different floor again, I don't know. So you have to keep screaming constantly so the ghost has like three or four indications where your last known location was so yeah a revenant slow if it doesn't see you or sense you and fast as heck if it senses you hears you or sees you and yeah i have to play with that ghost all the time i have to tease it and this time it actually deserved it <laughs> so i hope you like that one see you in the next one bye